Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So we're just at the Broad Arrows Auctions at the Monterey Jet Center and there's some unbelievable cars here as you can see behind me. Uh, so we're just gonna walk around and I'll show you some of the, uh, I guess the standout cars. There are so many standout cars, but uh, we'll have a look around and uh, let me know what you think in the comments below of the cars. Got a really nice Ferrari Dino here in this beautiful purple color. Let's have a look and see what the price is. 1968 Ferrari Dino. 206 GT, estimated price $750,000 to $950,000. So we've got a lovely Maserati MC20 for sale and you can see that crazy purple pearl in that yellow paint it really stands out in the bright sun. I will just see how much they're asking here for this car. So 2023 Maserati MC20, 225 to 275 Beautiful looking car. It's just an example of the many, many cars that they have here. They're all absolutely beautiful. Big private jets over there. But yeah, endless cars. This is just a small handful of them. There's a few hangers full of cars as well. So we'll keep looking around, see what we can see. Very nice Lancia Delta Integrale. It's a very special car. See this here. Let me just check out the price on this car. So it's a 1994 Lancia Delta Integrale Evolution 2 16V Blue Lord from $125 to $150,000. Nice car. So we've got a crazy Brothers G Wagon 6x6 700. Obscene, well, absurd car really, but pretty cool if you want to uh, stand out in the crowd. Definitely attract a few, a bit of attention with this car. Let's have a look and see how much they're asking. So it's 2004 Mercedes Benz G63 AMG 6x6 Brabus B63S 700. Estimated price 1.1 million to 1.3 million dollars. For white Ferrari Dino, let's see how much this one's asking. So it's a 1970 Ferrari Dino, 575 to 675,000. And there's a very nice yellow Ferrari Dino. So it's a 73 Ferrari Dino. 500 to 600 thousand dollars. Some of the private jets here. Let's zoom around here, another private jet. Be nice to be rich. Beautiful 427 AC Cobra here in black. And check out the price on this thing. So it's a 65 Shelby 427 Cobra SC Alloy Continuation, 250 to 300,000. I've got a very cool vector here in this uh, aqua greenish kind of color. Pretty amazing looking car, really. I'm just uh, see the price they're asking. So 1993 Vector Avtech WX3 prototype, 1.5 million to $2 million. Pretty cool looking car though. Vector, see the rear end. This stunning Porsche here, this thing looks absolutely insane. Fully decked out, race seats. Wow. What a stunning looking car. Ah, Manti Racing, love it. Let's see what we've got here. 2022 Porsche GT2 RS Club Sport 25, Manti Racing, 800 to a million dollars. Steering wheel there. What an extreme car, what an awesome looking car. Stunning, let's have a look around just at the back end. This thing looks really, really good. Let's look at the back here. GT2 RS Club Sport 25. What an amazing looking car, wow. Massive wing, carbon fiber everywhere. Cool cage, one seat, stunning car. And then just behind this car, we've got this, another insane Porsche. Look at that bonnet, all exposed carbon fiber. It looks absolutely crazy. Let's see what we've got here. 2019 Porsche GT2 RS Club Sport, 500 to $600,000. Race steering wheel, all decked out inside. Roofs all exposed carbon. And that is a crazy looking car. Again, massive rear wing. GT2 RS Club Sport. Stunning car. We've got a nice Ferrari F50 here. Beautiful car. This thing sounds fantastic. V12. I believe the engine was derived from F1. Stunning car. Let's have a look around here. Amazing. How nice is that? We'll just come around here. Roof off. Stunning car. We'll just come around the front of the car here. Just get a brief look. Lovely. Let's have a look and see what we've got going on here in terms of price. 1995 Ferrari F50. Price four to four and a half million dollars. 
And we've got this amazing Porsche RS Spider. This thing looks absolutely insane. So extreme. Let's have a look here. Can't imagine sitting in this car and trying to drive it. I know I couldn't drive it, but it would be absolutely insane. Amazing. We'll look around here. Yeah, it's a stunning car, that's for sure. Got a beautiful Bugatti Type 57C here. Lovely car. Let's have a look and see what we've got going on here in terms of price. So it's a 1937 Bugatti Type 57C, 1.75 to 2.25 million dollars. Very pretty car though. Lovely colors. Beautiful. We've got this amazing Mercedes-Benz 600 Lawn Gillette, I believe. Have a look at this, just initially. So 1966 Mercedes-Benz 600 Pullman Lawn Gillette. Price, 2.25 million to 2.65 million dollars. Amazing, amazing looking car. Let's have a look inside here in a second. I guess the epitome of luxury back in the 60s. And the 600, we'll just have a look inside. Just here, face-to-face -face seating. That looks fantastic. You can see it's got like a reclining window in the center there, so you don't have to listen to the driver talk to you. <laughs> Here. Let's see what we've got. 1996 Porsche 911 Carrera RS. Four to five hundred thousand dollars. Very nice car. So here comes one of these uh, well stunning cars in the auctions. It's beautiful, beautiful car. Immaculate condition. I don't even know what it is, but it looks. So check out this beautiful car here. It's a 1934 Cadillac V16 Fleetwood. So this thing has a V16 engine. Absolutely stunning car. And check out the little badge here, V16. Little Buick badge here. What an amazing car. So you can see it's pretty, pretty huge. Let's have a look inside. It's really pretty inside. Somewhat like Art Deco style. <laughs> Stunning Ferrari 288 GTO here. One of my favorite old Ferraris, like classic Ferraris. Beautiful, beautiful car. Pretty sure this had a V8 twin turbo. This car here, asking around 4.25 million to 4.75 million. Styled by Pinafrenia. We'll have a look inside. Very pretty car. This absolutely beautiful Maserati here. Never seen this actual model, but it looks absolutely beautiful. We'll just have a look at what it is. It's a 1956 Maserati A6G54 Zagato Berlinetto. Estimated price 3.25 million to 3.75 million. But as you can see, it's a beautiful looking car. Let just see if you can see inside here. Amazing. It's a lovely McLaren Elva. It's like in full exposed carbon fiber, which is pretty insane. If you can see here, you'll see all of the exposed carbon fiber. Stunning looking car. Got a tiny little air deflector there right in the center, if you can see. Yeah, quite amazing car. No roof, no windscreen. Uh, this one's asking around two to $2.25 million for this car. I mean, pretty special car. Got a very nice McLaren SLR Roadster. I believe they're asking about four to five hundred thousand dollars for this car. Yeah, four to five hundred thousand dollars, two thousand and eight Mercedes-Benz SLR McLaren Roadster. Very nice car. We have a beautiful Mercedes 300 SL Gullwing. As you can see here they're asking one point eight to two point two million. Beautiful car, stunning, stunning car. Let's have a look inside briefly. Okay, so this is a very special car. It's a 1967 Toyota 2000 GT. And yeah, if you know cars, you'll know this is very special. Beautiful car. Toyota 2000 GT. Estimated price, 850,000 to $1.1 million. Such a nice car. Beautiful little car. 
Toyota 2000 GT. Let's have a look inside. Very pretty car. A stunning Porsche 918 Spider here in black. Beautiful looking car. Let's see how much they're asking. 2015 Porsche 918 Spider, 1.85 to 2.1 million dollars. Has to be one of my favorite cars. Part of the Holy Trinity, created when they brought out the LaFerrari 918, which is this car, and the P1. Very nice. Lovely Ferrari 458 Speciale. This spec, in my opinion, is probably one of the best specs in this car, or else in yellow, but lovely car. Let's see how much they want. 2015 Ferrari 458 Speciale, estimated 330 to 400,000. That sounds surprisingly cheap to me, but it is what it is. Very pretty car. Let's have a look, you can see the engine here. And here we've got a Ferrari 575 Super America. Not a car you see every day. It's a pretty interesting car to see how much they're asking here. So it's 2005 Ferrari 575 Super America, estimated 300 to $350,000. The glass roof, it's uh, pretty cool. Here we have a Porsche Turbo Roof THR. It's a nice car, as you can see. The roof badge there. Let me just see how much they're asking. So it's a 1996 Porsche Turbo Roof THR, 550,000 to 650,000. The roof wheels, roof brake calibers. Just take a quick look at this beautiful Mercedes Benz 300 SL Gullwing again. Lovely orangey red color. 1956 Mercedes Benz 300 SL Gullwing Coupe. Estimated price 1.8 to 2.2 million dollars. Very pretty car. Just have a look past here, if you can see. Have a very nice Lancia Rally Stradale here. I think it's amazing. Very cool car. Let's see how much they're asking. So it's a 1982 Lancia Rally 37 Stradale. Estimated price five to six hundred thousand. Very nice. We've got the Abarth badge here. See the Abarth engine. And we've got a beautiful Lancia B24 Spider America. This thing looks beautiful. We'll just check out the price of this car here. 1955 Lancia B24 Spider America, estimated 1.1 to 1.5. So this is beautiful lineup of cars here. Standard SL, 4 GT, 4 GT. Lancia, another Lancia, and then a beautiful 300 SL Roadster. Mercedes-Benz 300 SL Roadster in this lovely cream finish. Absolutely stunning car, in my opinion. Let's see how much they want. So 1957 Mercedes-Benz 300 SL Roadster, estimated 1.3 to 1.6 million dollars. Such a lovely car. Let's have a look back here. There's another car for the auction block. And we've got a very special Lamborghini Reventon. Quite a rare car. Looks pretty amazing, very angular, you could say. Well, let's see how much they're asking. So 2008 Lamborghini Reventon, estimated price 1.8 to 2.1 million. beautiful Ferrari F12M, which I've actually never seen one of these actual models. Front end's a little bit different, looks somewhat like a Testarossa, but it's not. So 1996 Ferrari F512M, estimated price four to five hundred thousand dollars. Go, rear end looks, well, somewhat like a Testarossa, although the backlights are different. F512M, kind of cool, something a little different. So I've got a beautiful Ferrari 250 GT Lusso Berlinetta here. Beautiful, beautiful car. Let to see how much they're asking. So 1964 Ferrari 250 GT Lusso Berlinetta. Estimated price 1.9 to 2.3 million dollars. Very pretty car. 
Another very special car is this uh, Honda NSX Type R. Very cool car, I believe uh, Ant and Senna had a hand in developing these cars back in the day. Uh, let's see how much they're asking for this one. 1995 Honda NSX Type R. Estimated price, $550,000 to $650,000. Getting up there. Very nice car though. NSXR. Beautiful Ford GT. We'll just check out what the spec is and how much we're asking. 2006 Ford GT Heritage Edition. Estimated price, $575 to $675. Very nice looking car. The Heritage spec looks beautiful. Another lovely Ford GT here. Just we'll see how much they're asking. 2021 Ford GT, estimated price 900 to 1.1 million dollars. Beautiful car. Acropovic exhaust at the back. Have another beautiful Mercedes-Benz 300 SL Roadster here in black. Stunning looking car. Black wheels. We'll just have a look, see what they're asking. So 1957 Mercedes-Benz 300 SL Roadster, estimated price 1.85 to 2.2 million dollars. Beautiful car. Let's have a look inside here. 300 SL. The LaFerrari just leaving. I was just going to go and film it and he's leaving. How nice is that? In car park is a casual LaFerrari.